Well, hello, my senior friends. This is Debbie Pesca DiGiulio. Um, normally, you would see me doing the senior FYI, but today we're going to do something a little different. I am here today with Sally Branos and Nancy DeLegro Haas. And what we discussed doing was um, a craft with our seniors. And we were really hoping to have you in the uh, senior center to do this, but with everything going on, we were unable to do that. So Miss Sally suggested that we come to Revere TV and Nancy and I were chosen to try and do this craft, but we were assured by Miss Sally, this is a simple craft. Um, we are going to um, paint an eek and a boo. And when they're done, they're going to look like this. We hope. Uh, Miss Sally is off camera. She is going to give us directions. And these, these crafts actually are at the dollar store. Um, but what we do have at the Senior Center, and we were hoping to give to you, we have about 35 uh, craft kits. So they would include this craft, some paint, paint brushes, and then the little ghosts and stickers and a glue stick. So our first 35 um, people that ask for it will we'll get it to you s instead of having anybody come in. So again, uh, we wanted to do this live, but we're going to do it through Revere TV. And thank you, Revere TV, for doing this for us. So we're going to start with this one. We're hoping to do a Thanksgiving craft and a Christmas craft. And um, you can let us know how it works out. So I guess we'll start. Miss Sally, I have a purple mat, which does come with this. I have an eek. Nancy has a boo. And Miss Sally, go for it. Okay, so inside your kit, you will find some gloves. You can go ahead and put those on. And you'll have a tube of black paint. The black paint's going to go in the little white cup that you have. Okay, we will do that, Miss Sally. Actually, I think we already did that before. Yep. So we didn't make a real mess. Okay. Also, in your kit, you'll see that you have two paint brushes. Okay. We're going to get the brushes. sponge one. Okay. Okay, which is the bigger of the two. Mm -hmm. And you're just going to dip it in your paint. Now, paint travels a long way, so you don't have to soak it. You're just going to put it on, and remember to go in the same direction. And you'll see that it's wood that will probably suck the paint right in. Miss Sally, you said that um, you did get these in the dollar store, correct? Yes, I purchased these at the dollar store in Revere. Both of them I had to go to. Okay. So did you buy the one them down all? by Target. Okay. And the one over by the Rotary. Okay. I'm sure most people will probably have the paint in the Yep. Well, this really is sucking the paint right in. You were right on that. And one thing about paint. It does cover a lot of ground. So you just want to pull it. Nice and quick. Okay. So it shouldn't be heavy. Right. How you doing, Nance? Good. <laughs> and then inside your kit, I included a small brush if you want to get into the little nooks and cranny. So at the Senior Center, we, we did have arts and crafts, um, an arts and crafts room where people would do uh, painting and knitting and crocheting. I don't know how much like real arts and crafts, like projects like this they did. Um, so this is, am I getting inside the E or inside? You can. You can okay. if you want. Can I do it with this or should? Yes, you can. And okay. then... Also included is a small brush if you can't. Okay. I will tell you that I am not good at, not good at art. One thing I tell my little kids 
is <laughs> hot is from the hot. So take your time, enjoy yourself. <laughs> all my little preschoolers. So that's how you. we all know Miss Sally. She works with the preschoolers at Park and Rec. And um, they get to do this stuff for fun. So what do you do, Sally, at Park and Rec? Can you let everybody know? Yes, I teach just about seven preschool classes from cooking to arts and crafts to play groups, Monday through Friday. And she was good enough when I said I really didn't have anybody at the senior center to teach a craft, and I've been looking for somebody, and I think it's been hard for any senior to really want to come out and do, you know, we have our exercise videos, but for somebody to actually come out and do a craft on video, we have a lot of takers, so thank you, Sally, for this. I enjoyed it. I was trying to come out with something that was more for seniors than I'm usually working with babies. <laughs> wow, this is nice and simple for me. And when yep. you're done with this, you can hang it on your door. Front door, back door, or in your kitchen, whatever you want. Good job, Nancy. Thanks, Sally. Is she doing the outside already? Yep. You already did your inside, or you're not doing it? I'm going to do the inside after. She's cheating. She is cheating. I didn't know I was supposed to do that. And of course, you know, when you see the finished product, I was amazed at how cute they look finished. You really, um, you have an eye for that to you know, to, see, to, to just see something like this and then add to it to make it look. Thank you. Yeah. It's fun. I just try to make it fun, simple and fun. And I hope the seniors enjoy it. I hope they do, too. You know, it's, it, it's um, obviously, it gets lonely when you're just sitting home. And, and I think crafts are a great way to, to, to use your time. Oh, absolutely. Um, you know, Pinterest is a lot of fun to look stuff up for Christmas and Halloween and Thanksgiving, too. But, you know, the, 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 obviously what's great about this is you bought this um, at the dollar store. And just, just curious, like, if you were to put uh, it all together, like, what would you say the total price for this craft would be? The the eek and the boo signs were just a dollar. I just bought $10 worth of paint, and that was it, really. The stickers was just paper that I had at the rec center that I just cut into circles, and the ghost as well. So it's really a very inexpensive Expensive craft. craft. Yeah. Yep. And, you know, if you're a senior, that's, you know, that's what you'd be looking for is an inexpensive craft. And I guess if you're a mom with yep. kids, the same type of thing, you know. I always found art as fun. Not everybody is interested in sports. <laughs> so, yeah, you're right. I just, I had a um, brother who was very talented, very artistic. And um, I guess I wasn't interested because he was very artistic. <laughs> like I couldn't draw a straight line. Yes, but I think you're doing an excellent job. Well, thank you, Miss Sally. It's not hard to paint any sign. Right. <laughs> Nancy, yeah, you finished the outside yet? No, not yet. Nope. Okay. No. Okay. the inside. Just checking so in with you, Nancy. <laughs> A little commentary down there. Hoda, <laughs> come on.
I love that you got a mat for us because uh, I was trying to think of everything. Yeah. The gloves, the mat. I can re remember like one of the birthday parties for my daughter. Uh, they did one of those ceramic. I can't remember the places, the ceramic place where they, they would make a ceramic something yep. or other and then they paint and then they put it in the oven it was like one of their favorite, favorite. things as kids to do canvas painting now seems to be the rage yeah for birthday parties yeah even for kids yes because i know adults got into it for yep. you know for a while I love that. The kids like that. Art is so good for you. Anything to get them off the phone. The kids enjoy the art programs at the rec center. Good. I can have anywhere from 20 to 25 kids. Summer, my art camps go to 50. Really? A lot of times we have a waiting list on it. That's fabulous. I'm not surprised, though, because, you know, it, it's just not... I know even in the schools it's limited, so it's it's not something they see a lot of. And I, I, I really think it's something that you're born with, that talent. I mean, you can develop it. Just like I'm doing developing. <laughs> you're doing a wonderful <laughs> job. I'm having fun thinking I'm developing it. I just keep thinking, like, maybe two or three seniors will get together and do this. They'll have a good time. Oh, I'm sure they will. Yeah. We can be honest. We can tell them that I was in a panic. Yep. Right before we did this, because they kept saying, I'm so horrible at this. And you're almost done. You just got to come up the edge, right? Yeah. Wonderful. A couple of spots I miss, but. I bet you can't wait to open the senior center. I can't. Public. I really, really can't. Um, we've done some great additions um, to the center. The whole upstairs exercise room has been repainted. Um, the curtains are up. I tried, I'm trying not to say too much because I, when the seniors get back, I really want them to be surprised when they walk in. But it really looks awesome. And... Um, so I'm really excited for them to come back. It just, it looks so nice. You know, I, I know one of the things they would say to me when they were there is, oh, we love to go to Saugus. It's so pretty there. It, you know, it, it has curtains. It has this. It has that. And just those little touches made it a different place for so many seniors. And my theory Absolutely. was always that, you know, they work their whole lives. This is their senior center. Yep. they deserve to have a great place to come to. So I think when COVID is over and we get the clearance, you know, to have, even if we have a small number at one time, hopefully, um, I think they'll really in, be happy with what they see. And then we can really work on what programs they really want to um, get back there. So, And I bet they can't wait to come back. <laughs> I hope so. I really hope so. I would think so, though they, they you know, it's they, it, they have have great a great bond with each other, you know, and that doesn't stop. Right. They call each other, they talk to each other. That doesn't stop. And they they continue to call me. How are you? What's going on? You know, it's it's so nice to yes. to hear from them. Making friendships. Yeah. That's the best part of my job. 
Yeah, you're right. And I don't, you know, it doesn't matter if they're little kids, older right. people, you know, it's making, you know, making people happy and trying to take care of everybody, make sure everybody's all set. Once we get into the senior department and we get to bring them all in and do crafts, it'll be fun. They'll enjoy each other's company. Oh, I, I definitely do. I think there were things that were really missing there, and one of them is crafts. You know, it's, it's just these the simple things that, yes. you know, it's not about a big production. Okay. You're, yes, you're done, too. I'm done, yeah. You're Fabulous. all done, right? Yep. Okay, wonderful. You guys can take off your gloves if you want. Okay. Because we no longer need them. And I'm hoping that the top should be just about dried. Nancy, yep. yeah. Turn Deb, how are you on around. yours? The top of yours is a little bit more to dry? I got a little bit more to dry. I think because I was kind of, I think it, Nancy was right in doing her outside first and then. Probably doing her inside later because my outside kind of. Okay. All right. Go ahead. So, Nancy, you'll have <laughs> another bag. And inside there, there's a few stickers. And you can lay them all out. And really, there's no right or wrong way of putting those stickers on. I put them on there. I moved them around till I decided how I like them. And then I went ahead and glued them. And, we can, and the glue stick just goes right, right. on. Yeah. Also, so you're aware, the small ghost have peel back. Okay. So you can peel them off and stick them on. All the paper stickers have to be glued. And All right, so just the small yes. ghost. Yes, and the um, sequent ones, circles, also have peel back. You okay. can see it when you touch okay. it. You'll know that some of them have I see peel it. back. Yeah. The paper ones are the ones that have to be glued. And you can really, there's no right or wrong way of doing this. It's odd is from the heart. You can put it anywhere you choose. You can lay them out and come back and glue them, or you can just stick them wherever you think. I think I'm a copycat. Yep, that's fine, too. Yep, the big ghost needs a little glue okay. on his tail. Okay. Oh, the glue and that's it. That'd be good. Then you can hang these on your door or somewhere in your house or set it on a counter. This camera better not be on me right now, Bob Dumba. Oh, I'm trying to peel this. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Take it off now. We're waiting. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure they are sticky back, are they? The ghost? Yeah. Oh, the ghost? Have you done the little ghost at their peel back? Dance. Did I tell the wrong thing? No, I they're peel back. Okay, good. I'm like, oh I'm wait, I think I back. have it. I think I have it. <laughs> yes, victory. Put him right there. This, that's the worst part about being on camera right. is when you can't get it to work. <laughs> and I thought it was me making up words. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. No, no, but you know, I'm sure, I'm sure you have, you probably have some funny stories for us with little kids. kids. I mean, oh. what's, what could, what would be a funniest story working with a young kid? Oh, there's so many. Just the funniest thing is when they don't want to leave, when they come in and they don't want to leave and they're on the ground, they're crying because they <laughs> want to stay. <laughs> Yeah, I so can, cute. And yeah. you know, they forge friendships because they're coming so young. Yeah. They end up going to preschool together and through high school with each other. And they remember coming to the rec center. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, I bet they don't want to leave. Does she like cooking classes? Oh, I have to shut off the lights, put my jacket on, <laughs> and walk out with them. And how many of them think I live there? Yeah. Well, you get everything there. Yep. Except the bed. They think it's my house. Sunny Myers is my park. Sunny <laughs> <laughs> Myers, speaking of which, is starting to look really good. Yes. It's taking shape. Yeah. Nancy, take RJ to Sunny Myers. We usually go over to Whalen. 
actually. I think it's so back up. Yes. Wait till he sees Bo. Oh, he's going to be very excited. <laughs> How old is Ajay? He'll be two in November. What's he going to be for Halloween? Joe Exotic. <laughs> Are you dressing with up with him? No, I am not. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Dad will dress up like a tiger. That's good. <laughs> That's fun. Okay, I think I'm almost done here. Oh, really? <laughs> Make sure that camera's right on her trying to get that back off. I got it. <laughs> um, let's see, Miss Sally. I'm gonna use one more since it's here. Yeah, I mean, there's plenty. So there was plenty of paint. There was plenty of glue. There were plenty of stickers. I don't see anything that we would need any more of. Nancy Zowie can display our... I'm almost dying to see it. <laughs> don't be too excited. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put the other eek back. You probably copied it verbatim. All right. We ready? I'm ready. Okay. Miss Sally. Ta da. Ta da. Wonderful. Love it. Love it. Great job, ladies. Great job. Thank you. Thank you and Ms. thank Sally. you, Miss Sally, for doing this for us. Again, we have probably 35 kits at the Senior Center. Give us a call 781 286 8 155. Thanks, Nance. 8155. I blacked, blacked out for a minute. Um, eek. Boom. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.